Hey everyone, welcome back to another video, M692 here, and in this video I'll be showing you how you can fix Garrus Mod Textures. This will work for all versions, this is easy to do, and yeah, let's get into the video. Okay, so this is the uh, texture glitch that I'm talking about here. So basically, all the textures you can see that are loaded in are the textures within Garry's Mod which come with the game, but the other textures are textures that come from other sources such as Counter-Strike. So what we're going to be doing today is we're going to download the Counter-Strike source textures, and this is 100% free, it's not illegal, nothing like that, because we're not downloading the game, we're just downloading the textures which is needed for this game to run, these uh, maps. So yeah, this will fix all these problems like the invisible thing, the uh, pink and black uh, texture placeholders, and any other glitchy stuff like errors and lighting issues. So yeah, let's go into the video. Okay, to get started, open up a web browser. Go to my website, which is sites.google.com forward slash view forward slash the home of M692. Um, this is my new website, not the home of M692.tk. I'll leave a link in the description for easy access. Okay, this is the website here. If we go to resources and then CS textures, we can go into here. We'll wait for the download button to load and we'll click download. In here it will take you to this page, we're going to click the download button again, it will take you to here, we're going to click I'm not a robot, we're going to click the click here to continue button, and then we'll just need to wait 10 seconds. Then we'll click get link and it will start the download. We want to close the first thing if it's an add pop-up and we'll click the get link button again. As you can see it will automatically download here. This is a large file around 712 megabytes in size so it may take a while to download. Okay now we're just going to go to our file explorer. Now we're going to find our steam library. This is usually under local disk C Program files x86, Steam, and then Steam apps in here. For me, it's on a different drive, so I'll just bring up that folder now. Okay, so as you can see, we're in my Steam library here under local disk E. We'll go to Steam apps, common, scroll down and find Gary's mod. Double click that folder, and then in here, we need to go to Gary's mod, add ons. And then in here, we can dr drag in the files inside the zip file of the textures. Okay, so we'll drag that in from the zip folder. This will copy over here. And once that's done, your Gary's Mod file is ready to go. Okay, so we've finished the uh, files for the textures. And you can see our game looks normal, no light issues, no errors, everything looks normal, um, no missing textures, it all looks normal. So this should work, this works for all uh, maps that might be missing textures, unless for some reason they need third party textures, which is very rare. Um, yeah, thanks for watching this video guys, I hope it's been helpful. If you wouldn't mind subscribing, that'd help out a lot. Also commenting and liking the video also helps out a lot. Make sure to check out my website, sites.google.com forward slash view forward slash the home of M692. A link will be in the description as always. Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next video.